My name is Logan, and I might get in trouble for this one. Not legal trouble, but, you know. Sorry for not uploading, I've been really busy, and I swear there's a good reason for it. I've been playing Roblox. The chance of you beyond your human comprehension. <clears throat> we all know that Hypixel Skyblock players are incredibly lonely. Most of us are lucky to even have friends. I understand that some of you might want a girlfriend as badly as I want an editor. So in other words, very, very badly. Well, you've come to the right place. In this video, I'll show you how to not only find an eligible partner, but also how to mog everyone else and become the alpha male, or whatever the new generation calls themselves. This is a step-by-step -step guide to my masterfully developed Hypixel Skyblock dating plan, scientifically proven to be 100% effective at all times. Hey, if massive corporations can stretch the truth, I can too. But why should I listen to you? You're no different from me. What do you know about- Trust me, bro. I'm a very credible source. Maybe even the most qualified to talk about this. And I can prove it. Just take a look. Okay, you got me. To be honest, the only girls that talked to me in high school were the ones that got dared to by their friends, but I'm all you got. Someone did this four years ago, but that strategy is severely outdated. Plus, women have evolved since then. Just take a look here at the change logs. Oof, yikes, plus 50% BS detection. Not good for us. Before we figure out how to get a Minecraft girlfriend, we have to identify why we want one. As for the benefits, well, you tell me. You clicked on the video, you should know why you want one. But if you still need further convincing, just refer to basically every reason I stated in this other video. Plus add the cure to loneliness, the joy of your freedom being filtered, add the experience of dealing with another person's emotions all the time, add a large amount of sacrifice and being forced to compromise on many different things, and your wallet will even feel much lighter. That's not because you're getting stronger from your daily protein shakes, but more likely due to the lack of dollar bills in the purse. Hey man, you get what you pay for. Keep in mind that this is a guide to getting a virtual girlfriend, so you won't be able to, uh, physically interact with each other. It's starting to sound like there's actually more downsides to this than benefits. Uh, I want to immediately start off by recommending to, let's call it, switch teams. You hear me when I say this, it is much easier to get a Skyblock boyfriend than a Skyblock girlfriend. What? But... No, that, that's supposed to say the game is absolutely ridden with all kinds of boys. Jerry Hollowell would love it here, so if that's your cup of tea, have at it. <laughs> yeah, boy. First impressions are everything, and you have to make sure you look good. How you come across will dictate how your first conversation's gonna go. What I'm trying to say is, if you look horrible, you won't stand a chance. Start off by picking the right skin. This is a very important part of the process. You don't want to be approaching e-girls looking like this. Search e-boy on Planet Minecraft, and you should be all set. There we go. See? Look at that improvement. Wait. If you can't find a good skin to use, try wearing an impressive set of armor instead. You need to find a good middle point for the armor set. The right amount of showing off your goals, but not giving the impression that you have no life. Taking a weapon to show off might be a good idea. It'll show your willingness to protect her, or something. What? Having a full talisman sack is a bonus, because they love huge sacks, oh. e accessory sacks. This has quickly turned into a try not to get demonetized challenge. And of course, a lot of how you look just comes down to RNG. Luckily, you're e-dating, so you won't have to worry about looking like a depressed John Pork on his way to the slaughterhouse. <laughs> oh my god! Oh. I'll try to make this part as simple as possible by breaking the topics up into do's and don'ts. And considering recent events, some of you might really need to hear this. Starting off with something you should do, you should take initiative as often as possible. Nothing is ever going to get done if you just sit there and wait for someone else to approach you. It's really not that complicated, just don't be afraid to say hi every once in a while. What's up, brother? The next thing you can do is force your voice to be deeper. All, All you, you have, have to do, do is, is this. What's good, gang? Wanna hop on leave? Will you be my legs to my Israel? Be confident. As people that waste our lives escaping our hardships by playing video games, I can understand how this could be difficult, but I'm gonna try and actually give good advice for this one. Fake it till you make it. Seriously, try going up to someone either in-game or in real life and just manifest the confidence. I believe that the higher level fishing you have, the better your chances are. Fishing in Minecraft is an incredible demonstration of patience, and you'll need a lot of that when talking to girls online. Be chivalrous. It's a big word, but it means to be courteous and gallant. And if you know what those two mean, you're ahead of me already. And lastly, for the do's, you should ask a lot of questions. Ask how her day was, her favorite places to eat, and how I got my Minecraft text to look like that. Nuh-uh, I'm not telling. It's a secret. 
And now for the don'ts. Again, these are examples of things that you should not do when looking for a Minecraft electronic wife. First and foremost, do I not do act desperate. I am a man! Though, considering that all YouTubers are essentially street performers and beggars, we're very bad at this one. Please, for the love of God, do not correct her about Skyblock facts and strategies. It's not worth being right about everything all of the time and throwing the bag. Do not be mean. Don't be yourself. Everyone spreads this false idea of how being yourself will help you find the one, but it's just not true. Find an influencer that gets a lot of girls and base your entire personality around them. Like me, I'm a great example. I'm a great example of someone you should base your personality around. I don't base mine around anyone else or anything. Consider bringing along a cute pet when confronting possible candidates. You could bring the, uh, the wolf pet, or maybe the monkey pet. Really anything but the rock pet works. She might end up thinking you're schizophrenic if you show her that. Or the rift ferret. Nobody uses that thing. Make sure you're constantly talking about the gym and how high your max bench or squat is. If you don't even know what those mean, watch a few clips from Sam Sulek and regurgitate whatever he says. You could help her out in dungeons if she's stuck on a lower floor and carry the whole team. This is also a great way to establish her dependence on you. Too far, my, my bad, my fault. The last thing I can think of that would really impress her is having a low skyblock level. It shows that you have a life outside of the game and that you're responsible with your time. I apologize to anyone past level 200, your full box 200 pump clipped in this case, but nobody that's even remotely good at the game watches my content, so we're all fine, right? A few extra notes to add would be to not pay for female interaction, because you'll look like that special kid that the principal forced the popular girls to hang out with. Also try and stay out of the garden, because most girls don't prefer to be with guys that have too many hoes. Farming hoes. Damn, get your mind out of the gutter. Alright, now that all that's out of the way, do you feel prepared? No, don't bother, you never will be. But remember what a wise man once told you. Fake it till you make it. Seriously. Let's move on to finding women. I believe this process to be quite similar to hunting or fishing. There's a lot of animals running around that we'd rather let live, but few that can be defined as our prey. Hopping around hub servers with decent player accounts is a good start, and just looking around for any female looking skins, but unfortunately it's not that simple. As a lot of you guys know, you can find girl Minecraft skins everywhere you look. Problem. Most of these people are not women. It's very important to take note of this, as we want to make sure that you're not talking to a G-I-R-L. Or a guy in real life. Perfect. And since we can trust what everyone says online, we shouldn't feel the need to receive further evidence, and we can move on. You could also find lots of women in my Discord server, baby, which is linked down in the- Aha, I got you. There's still no Discord. You should have seen the look on your dumb face, dumb idiot, stupid, thinking I was gonna release the Discord. The time has come. You are ready. After talking to her for a long time and tons of preparation, it's time to take things further. It's time to finally get a Minecraft girlfriend. Consider everything you've learned from both me and your past experiences. It's all led up to this. Remember, the worst thing she can say is no. If it sounds scary, you're not alone, but you'll never be ready to take the leap of faith. Take a deep breath, start mewing, and... No, I'm sorry, but... I think we should just stay as friends. My heart! I loved it! <laughs> whoa, 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 okay, let's take a step back here. No need to overreact. It's all gonna be okay. We take our L's and learn from them. So we're hard stuck in the front zone, and it's good to recognize that. Let's pick ourselves back up and look elsewhere. According to the law of large numbers, the more women you ask, the higher your chances are of landing yourself in prison for harassment. You could try going to build battle, build some down badge structures, maybe a few signs with your discord tag and hope that they notice. Or maybe bed wars? No, no, only the top players get the girls over there, which is something that we are not. We could look around the Roblox version of Hypixel Skyblock. There's more girls over there compared to the original game. Uh, on second thought, maybe that's not such a good idea. I tried. I really did. Unfortunately, a girlfriend won't solve all of your personal issues, and AI is evolving rapidly, so worst comes to worst, we'll look into stimulating our brains with AI instead of real relationships. But let's think back to why you wanted a girlfriend in the first place. Was it for compassion? To feel loved? To experience being someone's first choice? Or maybe, is it just simply to fill that enigmatic void in your heart? Because that's what video games do better than anything else. They give us the opportunity to get lost in the game's infinite progression, leaving us distracted for hours at a time. 
exploring the rift, leveling milestones in your garden while watching your new favorite series at 11pm on a Friday with no other worries or thoughts, clearing dungeons, cracking jokes, and spending time with your boys. No, not, not like that. What I guess I'm trying to get at here is, I really don't think finding a girlfriend is the ultimate key to being happy. Yes, it could help, it could really help a lot, and I don't want to discourage you from trying. But if you really let yourself get lost in a hobby, no matter what that hobby is, that void in your heart that you can't describe, it won't weigh you down nearly as much, and you'd be happy just doing your own thing. Yes, even if that thing is wasting your time on a Minecraft server. It's not the most healthy way to go about enjoying your life, but I'd be crazy to think I could convince y'all to get off the game and talk to real girls. Ah, who am I kidding? What do I know? I make Hypixel Skyblock content online. No downtime, baby! The only real, tried and true method of getting a girlfriend in Hypixel Skyblock is telling her that you watch iCalazar on YouTube. It works every time. Go ahead and try it yourself. So like the video and comment something for the algorithm, or you will be doomed to die alone.